Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about ROMs. ROMs are defined as a little program often used in emulation. So, for example, uh, if you start a Visual Pinball X table, uh, we're going to start The Walking Dead. And uh, we're going to, and I'm sure you've seen that before if you're familiar with uh, Visual Pinball. After you launch the table, or you're trying to launch the table, you're going to get an error message. And this error message says that ROM is not found. That means that this game needs a ROM to run properly. So the ROM is a small program, let's put it that way. And uh, you're going to need to search. Uh, I usually just search Google for the name that was prompt on the screen. So for example, you will see um, TWD underscore uh, 156H. So that's the, the file name that we're looking for. So I'm just going to, you know, Google that. And uh, the first hit is from VP Universe. Uh, we actually got the file right here. You're going to need to log in with a free account and click download the file. Once you've got the file downloaded, uh, do not unzip the file. That's really important. It needs to remain zipped. So what you're going to do is you're going to open the uh, visual pinball folder uh, wherever it is located for this tutorial we've told people to use C slash pinball and then under pinball is visual pinball so we're gonna navigate to it and you're gonna copy the file and uh, you're gonna go to uh, vpin pin name and ROMs and drop that file the zip file in the ROMs folder and now you just restart VPX and uh, we're going to restart The Walking Dead and click play. And voila! We created a section in our guide which is the ROM list chart so you can quickly check for the ROM uh, required for the game. So we'll click on the W. Uh, it's actually hyperlinked, so it will bring you right to the letter. So click W. We're going to check The Walking Dead, see how many versions there are. We're going to check the one we're looking for, which is this one here, and it tells you which ROM is required. It is an awesome table. Uh, we're going to do some gameplay at some point with this table. I love it. And especially with all the effects, the lights and all that. So there you go, folks. Um, it, it's that simple. Uh, just make sure you have the ROM. And um, unfortunately, there's no ROM pack that you can download. You're going to have to do that manually. Uh, you're going to have to... Uh, that's why setting up a, vir a virtual pinball machine takes so long. It's all these little details. But you really only have to do it once. Once you've got it set up to your liking, back it up. Uh, what I do is I actually uh, create all, a zip file of all my my folder structure and I save it somewhere uh, on like an external hard drive and I bring it to work and this is my safe storage and I always keep a few copies because I mean you're gonna spend like literally hundred of hours uh, trying to set up these machines to your liking and once you've got it hey you don't want to lose it thanks for watching guys